building stuff and engineering's always been something that I've kept in mind. You learn a lot really quick and you learn by doing. It's nice to see what you're doing and be able to fix, you know, actual, actually fix the problem yourself. Dad's a businessman and my mom was a flight attendant. All the people are very nice and you actually know your classmates here. It just takes teamwork. That's the biggest challenge for the day. Robots may have emerged from mankind's fascination with their own existence. The puppets of yesteryear have become mechanized entertainers today. From car manufacturing to food packaging, robots today continue to do the job faster than man, and rapid progress in technology has resulted in their growing use. Today's advanced robots can cook your pancakes to order. There is no difficult problem. Even you know, the highly advanced research that's going on right now, it's just simple math in steps. Even though it's intimidating at first to see something, if you take a step back and say, okay, what's really going on here, it's easier to understand. A very promising field and a good future for me to continue my interest in robotics because I think it's in a very high demand and it's a very futurist technology. The beautiful Orange Coast College campus is located in the heart of sunny Southern California. Our robotics students have a fully stocked lab to work with. Recently winning the local VEX competition, the enthusiastic students here are at the top of their game. The robotics class starts with the basics of statics. But even with this knowledge alone, you can build successful money-making games today. I finished the program out in 2008 with the entry-level certificate, and then I applied that to a job. I would say uh, about 85 right now. I'm making just about that right now. Really helpful, and it was really important to me and my career. I said the starting pay is 67000 a year. The uh, cap is over six figures. Where will the future of robotics lie? Will it be robots that carry us from place to place? Or robotic cars that drive themselves? Today, children can buy inexpensive robots that can seemingly do everything, except their homework. Or, Will the future of mankind be dictated by the few, those in charge of the military? Will there be a future where animals will dominate mankind? Or will robots continue to stay behind the scenes, human-like yet unable to escape the boundaries of technology? What will the future bring? Join Orange Coast College Robotics today and create new robots that surprise, entice, and help mankind 